Hey everybody, I wanted to show you guys the tote that turned me into a tote guy. I'm Stephen Casimiro from Adventure Journal, and before these Yeti totes came along, I was just a backpack guy, a duffel bag guy. I was not into totes at all. But a couple of years ago, Yeti came out with what they called the goat of totes, the greatest of all time. It's called the Camino Carry All. This is a 35 liter, this is a 20 liter. I was like, okay, that's a big claim. Let's see what this is all about. And within a day of getting my hands on it, I had fallen in love with the utility, the functionality, the elegance, the aesthetics, everything about this tote I loved. The brilliance of it is really simple. It's one main compartment and it stands up on its own. The opening stays open on its own. That's it. It doesn't seem like much, but if you've ever had a tote that collapses on itself, you'll really understand why. This is just simple. It is, um, in typical Yeti fashion, it's really heavy duty. It has a rubberized bottom. Um, it has welded seams. It is warranted for three years. It will hold, Yeti claims, up to 1,500 pounds on these webbing handles. It's waterproof on the bottom and waterproof inside, so you could throw it down in the muck, or if you wanted to carry water from uh, a creek to camp, you could do it that way. I've had mine for two years. The bottom shows almost no signs of wear. I've dragged it, I've dropped it, I've thrown it. I mean, there's a little bit of discoloring, but that's it. There's a little bit of fraying on some of the threads, but not that much. Um, yeah, I mean, a little bit right here, but uh, otherwise it's good. The handles are super comfortable. It has these rigid handles down here which if, the, if what I have inside is too fat for this little hook guy, I will throw a carabiner on the outside and then I can fit a little bit more without my stuff falling out and do it like this. The handles are really comfortable no matter how much weight you have in them, uh, in it. They slip over your shoulder really easily the bigger one I have used to carry muddy boots, um, firewood, food car camping, uh, a sandy wetsuit, my 20 pound cat, pretty much anything you can imagine I have put in here that I could put in here, I have put in here. There are two zippered pockets on each side, which I use for flat stuff. And then these compartments, flexible, right here. So again, if something's wet and gross, it's really good for separating. Um, let's see, the warranty is three years. Um, as I said, I've had this for two and it shows almost no signs of wear. So um, I don't know, treat it right. It will probably last forever. The larger of, the, of these two, the 35 liter is 150 bucks. The smaller 20 liter is 130 buck, bucks, and then there's a, uh, a huge big daddy that is 50 liter and goes for 200. This size is perfect for going to the market, for a gym bag, um, day trips. This one, again, you can take that guy in there and you're good to go. I'm Stephen Casimiro for Adventure Journal. Subscribe for more outdoor gear reviews and thanks so much for watching. Adventure Journal is a quarterly print magazine featuring inspiring stories, incredible photography, and fantastic design. If you love traveling, the outdoors, and adventure, you'll love AJ in print. Support independent media and subscribe at subscribetoaj.com.